some of the stuff with these trader funding programs and the other day finding out another little gotcha that I didn't know about before was if you're in a $10,000 trade and you close it out at 7,500, like literally intra trade, like not after the trade, but you, you know, you're letting the trade run, letting it run, doing really well and to your position, you get really good trades like on a run up 10,000, but it pops back down to 7,500 and you close the trade out. Oh, I'm sorry. That was a $2,500 drawdown. You're going to have to reset your account. You literally like close the day out it would have been plus 7,500, but they're not going to let you keep it. Yeah. Watermark high. Yeah. Being big P and L spikes and wipe you out. So yes, yeah, so let's say that you catch a big one, folks, what they want you. So basically the best type of strategy there is to do what we're doing right here. They want you to play low time frame, target one, target twos, boom. Target one, target twos, boom. Consistently, they want you hitting target. Folks, this is what our system is fine tuned to do. Go to town. Yeah, I mean, you should just be punching in tiny ATMs, hitting T1s, because none of those catching a big runner is basically going to work against you. Biggest bunch of horse manure I've ever heard. So you should just go big size on T1s and T2s. And forget adjusting size because they're, I mean, they're, it's a game. They're playing a game. A game that they just don't want you to lose. Yeah, you can't let runners run with Apex. You really can't. Press the like button, share, subscribe, and comment below with your thoughts and what you'd learn. Watch this next video.